Sherlock Holmes and the Mind Palace. Did you know that Britain's famous fictional detective Sherlock Holmes used mnemonics too? In Arthur Conan Doyle's first Sherlock Holmes story, A Study in Scarlet, Holmes states, I consider that a man's brain originally is like a little empty attic, and you have to stock it with such furniture as you choose. What Holmes is describing here is a memory technique called the Mind Palace, also known as Loki, which uses location and imagery to aid memory. However, this mind journey technique dates as far back as the days of the Roman Empire. It was first used by ancient Roman and Greek public speakers as a mnemonic technique to help them carry out their public speeches without the aid of notes. But what is this method? And how does it work exactly? Well, the technique works by a process of association. First, create a mental image of a building or place that you're familiar with and imagine walking through it. Pay attention to specific features such as the furniture in each room. Once you have a clear image of the house in your mind, start associating facts or information with specific objects in the rooms. Next time you need to recall something, visualize walking through your mind palace and retrieving the stored memories. It's important to visit your mind palace repeatedly in order to burn the information into your long-term memory.